<laughs> so hi guys oh i need to be way closer <laughs> my bed is really high hello <laughs> like really you good okay <laughs> so hi guys So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you read the title of the video, I'm gonna be doing a Christmas, what I got for Christmas haul. To th Is it called a haul? Wait, what I got for Christmas 2020. Yeah, that sounds really short, but what I got for Christmas 2020. So of course, I this video is not meant to brag or show off anything I got for Christmas. I'm really grateful for what I did get. And this is just a fun video to show what I got because I love watching these videos. I know I'm a little late, but that's because I was like with family a few hours away and all my stuff was here for the most part. So I couldn't do that, you know. And then I didn't have time on Christmas Day to film at all because it was just like we left at noon. It, it's a whole thing. <laughs> And I'm also really sorry about the lighting because when I filmed over there last year, the lighting was really good and then now it's just really weird. So this is like the best lighting I have. Also with that, I thought I was gonna film over there. So all my stuff is literally laying on the ground right now. It's everywhere. So I probably just showed you most of it, but we'll go, we'll start anyway. Okay, so we're gonna start with clothes and the first store I'm gonna start with is Brandy Melville. So I got this shirt. I don't remember what it's called, but I just really like it because the colors, it just looks so, I just love the colors. They're so good together. And it's just an oversized shirt. So then the next thing I got was the crystal hoodie. And I honestly love these because they're so short. So if you're wearing high-waisted jeans, it kind of accentuates what the waistband looks like. I don't know. Some waistbands are really cute on jeans. So I don't know. I really think it's cute. It'll go with any kind of pant. So but Next, I got the rosa sweatpants which are the best sweatpants ever they're so soft and if you have long legs they're perfect and they're so soft inside and i love them because they're high-waisted so they can go with crop tops and it's just way more comfortable with high-waisted pants like next i got the christy hoodie i think and it's just the oversized hoodie i'm literally wearing the brown one right now that i got a couple months ago which i've been living in because it's so comfortable i have a couple of these colors already and I'm glad I have the black one because like I said with the crystal hoodie, it's black so it'll go with everything. Next, I got, I don't know the exact name of this, but it's just a Malibu sweatshirt. And it's oversized again, which I just love oversized clothes. It goes so good with leggings or just any anything. And it's just so cozy, especially since it's winter. Then I, last thing from Bernie Melville, I think, I got another Christie hoodie. Oversized and it's in sky blue, which is so pretty. I don't wear a ton of color, I feel like. Well, I do, but just not pastels. So I think it's good that I went out of my comfort zone and got a pastel one. So from PacSun, the first thing I have is this Playboy sweatshirt. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but like this side has a more dark tie-dye on it and then this side's just a plain like mauve color. Not really mauve, but pinkish purple color then i got the sweatpants that go with it and these things these sweatpants are so soft there's a little playboy bunny right on them and it's like half and half the tie-dye and then just plain color and it goes with the shirt of course and it's so comfortable i've already worn it i've already worn a lot of this stuff so if you don't see tags on them i probably wore it because christmas was like a week and a half ago and then the other thing I got from PacSun was this, I don't know if it's animal print, I think it's just a different kind of pattern on it, but I thought it was like some zebra print, but it's not, but I love it, it's so soft, and it like cinches at the bottom, 
this will be perfect to wear with sweatpants i always feel like cinched at the bottom sweaters are so good with sweatpants or jeans i hate wearing those with leggings next i'm gonna show what i got from urban outfitters so of course you guys have probably seen these so many people have them so it's kind of basic but i got these jeans you've probably seen them before like i said honestly so many people have them they're just some mom jeans they cuff at the bottom ah yeah they cuff at the bottom and they just have rips in the front and on the back <laughs> then i also got this sublime shirt which like a lot of people also have this i have the most basic things i swear but it's this and i love the color of it and i need more oversized t-shirts because i don't have a ton i think it's really good with like a turtleneck underneath it looks so cute and i just love it it's kind of distressed too where's where are they oh you see this hole it's very distressed look at that's a hole that means the shirt's distressed then the last thing i got from urban outfitters was this nirvana sweatshirt this is another thing that I just really like the colors on. Like, this color in general, I love. But then the colors on it, they're just so neon and I just love it. And it's oversized. Then from Misguided, I got this flannel or shacket. I don't know, people are calling them shackets now, but I just kind of refer to them as, like, thick flannels, oversized flannels. But I love the colors. Like, okay, the camera makes it not look as good as it is, but, like, the browns and the blues... <gasps> Brown is like my favorite color in clothing right now. You can probably tell. I'm obsessed with brown. Then also from Misguided, I got these jeans, which I feel like also a lot of people have. But I guess that's why they're so, a lot of people like them because they're just, they're really distressed. They look so good on. Their mom jeans, distressed. I love the color wash of them. I love them. <laughs> I feel like I said that with like everything. Then from, I think the store is called Glicks. Yeah. I got this sweatshirt and oh my gosh, I just, it's so minimalistic, but that's like what, what I like about it. And it's oversized, of course. I love the smiley face design on clothes. And then also from that store, I got these tan sweatpants, which honestly, okay, like kind of brown. Would that go with this maybe? That'd be kind of cute. But the high, the waistband is like this kind of cinched design on the top which I feel like would go better with like a crop top so then you can really show the top. But they're, they're oversized sweatpants and they are so soft. They're so soft, I love them. Then from Revice Denim, I love their jeans. They're such nice quality. They're the straight leg jeans with a rip on one knee, which I am obsessed with the look of straight leg jeans with the one rip or both rips. But I really like these jeans. Oh, they have a rip on the bottom too. Maybe I won't be able to wear this to school. I didn't realize there was a rip right there. But I love them. I love Revice Denim, honestly. Their jeans are such good quality and they're definitely worth it. Something in my eye. <laughs> okay. So the last jeans I have are from Target and are honestly Target stepping up their game with clothes. But they're these straight leg, not straight leg, I think straight leg or mom jean and then they have the big rips in the middle you don't I've seen a bunch of these where it's like big rips in the middle I've only seen the like kind of I don't know what I'm saying I'd call them straight leg jeans but I love them and the wash of them is such like a pretty blue you know it's like light but kind of tealish you know yeah next of all we have one of my most favorite things that I got it is the blazers and oh my gosh i've been wanting these for so much i couldn't decide if i wanted the black ones or the coral ones but when i these look huge they're really not though i think they're a size eight i don't know why they look big but i love them and i love the color of them like i said i was gonna go with the black but i feel like i have so many black and white shoes already that this color i don't have anything in shoes and when i tried it on i actually tried it on in store with the playboy outfit and i think the color just really popped with that honestly so that was my favorite thing that i got and now that i'm done showing like the clothing items i'm gonna show the accessories i feel like that's like right after the clothes no next from paxson i got this i could probably put it with the paxson but i was just gonna go clothing accessories so it's just a scrunchie and i think it's so cute because it's like if you have it in your hair it's just kind of like 
it drapes down. You know, I can't talk. Then I got three Pura Vita bracelets. And oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with the color combinations. Like they're all, like this one's very like bright and pastel-y. This one's more of a blues. And then this one's like in the middle of the two. Then the last two necklaces I got, or like jewelry accessories, I got were this 2005 necklace. I really wanted this because I feel like the age jewelry is like really in, like your birth date, your birth year. Like, have you seen those, like, rings and then the necklaces? That's what I like about this. It's just really, I don't know. I like it. Okay, then I got a Pisces necklace because I'm a Pisces. And I really like how dainty it is. Because dainty jewelry is always just something you can throw on without it being really, like, a lot. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now that I did, like, accessories and stuff like that, I'm going to move on to, like, beauty stuff. I'm going to move on to beauty stuff. Okay, so the first thing I got was the Ariana Grande Moon Perfume. You dumb bitch. What even is Moon Perfume? It's literally in a cloud-shaped holder. SMH. It smells so good, and I honestly see the hype with it. Like, I know why people like it. I wish you guys could smell it, but it is so pretty. It comes in such a pretty little cloud thing, which I think is so cool. Then you can, like, have it out. Or honestly, if you're traveling, this would be good, because then it won't, like, break. Less likely chance of breaking, you know? Then I got Mario Badescu Hyaluronic Dew Cream, which I, it honestly works so good on my skin. Like I said, I already used some of the stuff, but I used this already and my face feels so soft after using this. I added it in my skincare routine. It like gives you the dewy glow, which I think is really natural. It looks really good. Last of all, for like beauty stuff, I got this Glossier bag. I know it's not a beauty thing, but all the Glossier products I got actually came in the bag. So I wanted to show it. And I really love it. So the first thing I got in here, you can just tell it's glossy by the bubble wrap. So the first thing in here are just cotton rounds, which I can always use. Next, it's this soothing face mist, which it just makes me feel so good. Especially when I'm like really tired or something or just like not up to doing things. If you spray this, it just kind of wakes you up and it is really refreshing. Also in there was Niacinamide Zinc Serum, which I already have. It's in the Ordinary and it works so good. So I'd be interested to see what the difference is between the Glossier and the Ordinary. Then in the other little package, there's Balm.com's. The zipper fell off. Okay. How am I supposed to get this open? It's not zipping now. What the heck? I'm just gonna open it like that. It's so random. Okay, so I got the two bomb.coms. The first one is birthdaybomb.com and the other one is coconut, which actually I got a couple bomb.coms before and the coconut one is my favorite. And then I brought it to school one day and I lost it. And I haven't found it since, which makes me really upset because it was like brand new at the time. Next, the last things are mostly like room decor and stuff and just like other little miscellaneous things. So that's the last thing I'm going to show. Okay, so like I said, a lot of these things are room decor. So the first thing I got are vines and I already opened them as you can tell. But if you're getting these, there's like a ton of extras in here. So I use some. I don't know if you can see, but if you look... Okay, like I was, like I was saying, if you look up here, I already put some on my ceiling and I really like them. I think greenery is like my favorite part, like my favorite room decor piece and vines are honestly just an essential. So I'm glad I have them. The thing I got is this cool moon shelf. It's like really cool and what I think I'm gonna do, since it hangs on your wall, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put little succulents on here. I think it looks so cool. I don't know where I'm gonna put it though. I already have so much stuff on my walls. Then what I got, I got a record player and I'm so excited to put this together. Like I've been wanting to put this up, but I waited for the video. I guess I could have just showed the box, but I don't know if you can hear it. It's, it's still in there and I can't wait to put it up. It's the Crossley Cruiser Deluxe and it's in white sand. In case you guys wanted to know, I don't, probably didn't want to really you probably don't really care then i got a record to go with it and i already opened it i don't know why but because i didn't open my record yet record player yet but i got a record vinyl it's kendrick lamar's and it's so cool on the inside i've never owned a record player or vinyls so i really think it's i think it's really cool how they just have these designs in there 
so cool i can't wait to play it then i got another succulent and it's really pretty the glass or not the glass this the, like stone of it is so pretty how it has the little lines and honestly i know i got so much greenery for my room but that's like my favorite piece in my room is greenery it like really makes it look really clean and everything i just love the color green <laughs> No, it fell on the floor. So I guess if you're wondering what that dropping thing was a couple minutes ago, that's what it was. And now there's dirt all over my floor. So that's fun. So I guess other than the succulent that's spilt all over my floor, I got another LED clock. This one is really cool. It's an LED. I'm so excited to put this up too. I literally waited to unbox all this stuff to make this video. So be thankful. Then a couple little things are I got a film camera and I got um, film for my Polaroid camera because I'm always taking pictures and they're always good to have. So the last thing I got, which is my big present, is a new mattress. You guys can barely tell like it's a new mattress, but my bed is like twice as high as it was. So I'm really thankful. And one of my favorite things, this blanket oh my gosh i don't know if you guys understand how obsessed i am with the color sage green but i'm like obsessed like oh this blanket's so cute and it's so soft i don't know if you can tell it's like a powder sage green and i love it like my two favorite colors now are brown and sage green so like this against this i'm just like obsessed right now so thank you guys so much for watching this video like i said none of this video was to break or show up anything I got it was just a really cool idea and I see everyone doing it and I am obsessed with watching them like I binged them on Christmas day so this is just kind of to show what I got and honestly I love watching them because anything I do with gift cards watching the videos kind of gives me inspiration for what I want to buy with them you know so thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure to subscribe to my channel make sure to put on post notifications I know I have not been active at all on YouTube but like this last year has been kind of crazy and it's like literally 2021 i forgot about that okay well you're probably seeing this past new year's but i hope 2021 for all of you guys is a way better year than last year thank you so much for watching and i will see you next video bye bad bitch in a lake tell me that she made the trip shorty better tell ya with them college